Hello, this is Techie Doodle Doo, and today we are going to have a look at the Logitech MX Anywhere 2S. So, as you can see, it's a little computer mouse. <laughs> and in this video, we will start by looking into some specifications. Then we will head on to the software and have a look at that. And in the end, I will say my opinion about this mouse. Let's go ahead. <laughs> so here we have a close-up of the mouse. It comes with this little dongle, which speaks with a mouse in 2.4 gigahertz radio. So you can just connect this into your USB plug. And you can also not use this and only use Bluetooth instead. So under the mouse, you can see a power button. Just use your nail to switch it on or off like that. And here you can switch between different Bluetooth devices that it is connected to. As you can see, it has some soft parts here, which gets scratchy quite fast. Here we have two buttons on the side, which by default is forward and backward, but you can customize these. You also have the scroller, which I really like because you can choose between the infinity scroll mode, which is this really satisfying scrolling. I will try to show you like that. So just like a fidget spinner or anything. <laughs> and you can also click the wheel itself to switch to this normal scroll mode. I don't know if it has any name, but uh, hopefully you can hear the clicking noises. You can also press the scroll wheel to either of the sides. So these are buttons as well, which also is programmable. And you can, for instance, use them to scroll from side to side. And also you have this customizable middle button right here. And at the end here, you can charge the mouse using micro USB. And of course, you also have the standard right and left mouse buttons. So let me show you the software real quick. So here we have the Logitech option software. And as you can see, the buttons that we can customize are marked here. So for instance, if you want the scroller left button to do something else than scroll left, you can just pick and choose whatever you want here. And for the middle button, we have some more options because we can choose to hold it in and also move the mouse either up, down, left or right to get different actions. And if you go to point and scroll in the top menu here, you can choose a pointer speed. You can also choose smooth scrolling, which is an acceleration when you scroll. And also you can choose the scroll wheel direction to be inverted if you would like that. And we also have the flow option here. And as you can see, you can connect two computers to the mouse simultaneously. And it will all act as if you are using an extended desktop. So you can just move the cursor from one computer to the other one. And that's about it for the main settings. I've had this mouse for about three and a half years and used it for about two and a half years while going to the university. And after that, it has been laying in my backpack. But now I have dug it up again because the mouse that I use for the desktop computer quitted on me and it doesn't work anymore so I'm using this at the moment so overall I really like the mouse because it has been very practical bringing this with me when using my laptop um, 
it has worked on every surface that I've used but to be fair they advertise that it would work on even glass so but that's nice because I don't really want to bother bringing a mouse mat in my backpack also the battery life is awesome I have charged it twice <laughs> And I have not been using it plugged into power, so really good battery life. Uh, not a lot of scratches at all, which you probably already saw in the close-up. You also have these softer parts on the sides, which are comfortable and not sticky, which I really like. And it's fairly easy to clean as well. It also has some weight to it, which I find comfortable because I prefer having a tiny bit of resistance when I use the mouse. When it comes to the sound, I can try to show you here. So, not the loudest and not the quietest, <laughs> I would say. It's just the normal clicking sound that you expect from a mouse, to be honest. And probably my favorite thing about the mouse is the wheel and the fact that it has the infinity mode, which I really love because it's so practical when scrolling through a huge document, searching from a, for a specific thing inside the document. It's awesome. And also the option to scroll sideways is really nice if you're working on huge excel documents for instance that goes way through the alphabet <laughs> so all in all i don't really have anything negative to say about it it is of course not the most ergonomic mouse because it's this tiny mouse so your hand fits over it <laughs> like that and <laughs> when using it you will get tired after a while so for your home office or your work i would suggest using something a bit more ergonomic but as a travel mouse it is awesome thank you so much for watching this video please leave a like if you did and also consider subscribing and i'll see you in the next video have a good one